So naturally the Springbok fans were there in force to see South Africa begin the defence of their trophy at Murrayfield. Scotland leading 6-3 after two Kenny Logan penalties when South Africa broke through. Brendan Venter, ex-London Irish, with their first try of this World Cup. South Africa leading 13-9 after successful kicks by Yanni De Beer. Scotland, though, with a spirited attack. And Martin Leslie, the adopted Kiwi, just as he did against France in the Five Nations, touching down. This stage, Scotland being willed on by a partisan crowd. And the Five Nations champions testing the World Cup holders. Martin Leslie, only his eighth Scottish cap, but he's made a big impression in the pack. The South African three-quarters starting to click. Dion Kesa, Robbie Fleck. A try that puts South Africa back in front. But they gave away their third penalty. And Kenny Logan obliged. Scotland ahead again. Bobby Skinstad had an ordinary game until he linked with Kesa and Brendan Venter. Jamie Mayer on for the injured John Leslie and Budge Poutney to the rescue for Scotland. It was a game played at a frantic pace. Scrum half, Jupp van der Westhausen, did a double take and then passed out to Oli LaRue. The massive Natal prop on for Oz Durant. He took the chance to score South Africa's third try and put them back in front. Six foot tall, 20 stone, like a runaway steamroller. Once upon a time, he played squash. Now he just flattens them. Gregor Townsend, probably guilty of trying to do too much. This one was too high for Scott Murray. Dion Kayser escaped. The mistake well punished. And Scotland up against it. Townsend, in fact, probably still not fully fit after his knee operation. But he did brilliantly well here to find Alan Tate. And the centre... A veteran of the 87 World Cup touched down. But that was the last time Scotland were in contention. Robbie Flex set up flanker Andre Venter for a good try. South Africa hadn't lost to Scotland since 1969, and the run looked certain to continue. Appropriately, the sixth and last South African try was scored by Jupp van der Westhausen, his 27th try in 53 tests. Captain of South Africa after the sacking of Gary Teichman, he led the team to victory in their last Tri-Nations match, and now.